happy Sunday. I'm organizing my dress bin today as I'm watching the Hallmark Channel for depressing romantic movies. Yay! And look, my door is leaking. It's leaking really bad. Look at oh, I just spotted a new leak. But at least it's over the shower. And this is my living room. My door is leaking. And this is the update on my bed. Covered in plastic. The walls buckling in. There's the ceiling and there's a new dedication. Father and son playing football. And a major storm on the beach. That's dedication. Just like me, this old apartment, I painted it myself. I love it. With all its problems, I love it. I won't give up. I don't give up very easily. But that's a good father right there. That is a good father right there. Teach us fun how to, teach his son how to play football. Look at That car has snow on it. It's crazy. People are like, why are you filming it? And I don't get to see it much. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, I should have charged my uh, my camcorder. But oh well, I'll just use my phone. Phones always work good. in a strange town. If you don't see us anymore, go to Grand Blossom. <laughs> Bridget says this is where they hide the bodies. I'm pretty sure. I think I already saw one. <laughs> I don't even know where we're at. I don't think we're in Pear Blossom anymore. <laughs> it's not sand. That's really snow. I swear. I swear it's snow. Snow. Guess where we're at? Snapchatting it. It's a dessert. It's pretty enough to eat. Yeah, of course it is just the way. I'm in Holly's guest house. We just had brunch. Now we're chilling in the guest house, me and Bridget. Look at all these scrapbooks, Bridget. Look at all these scrapbooks. Crazy. Bridget, what are you doing? Do you find any ghost? Not yet. <laughs> There's some ghosts in those books. For days, thank you, Postmate. Yummy, make yummy. Dinner time. Happy Hump Day. It is Wednesday. Yay! <laughs> Happy Hump Day. What's for breakfast, Bridget? Cake. Chocolate cake. Flower pot cake. Flower pot cake. I forget the name of the restaurant, but. Mmm. Sorry, on the road again We're coming down the highway Don't know the words But we're on the road again Bye, baby Well, hello, everyone It's the Stacy and Bridget show We're driving We're leaving Vegas We got to see Holly It was nice We had chocolate cake <laughs> For breakfast For breakfast Sushi for dinner You know when I brushed my teeth this morning And I was like, um having coffee and I brushed my teeth and everything and then all of a sudden I had a piece of ginger in my tooth <laughs> and I had 
ginger and coffee. For That's weird. Yeah, you know, I get stuck. I get stuck in those little crevices. I ate too much chocolate cake. Now I feel nauseous. Yeah, I ate just enough. But we're leaving Vegas, and uh, we'll probably do some junk food. That'll make me feel better. That'll make us both feel better. And uh, drinking water. And uh, that's shocking. It's shocking. I am actually thirsty. I'm actually thirsty. But we had a nice day in Vegas. We had like a day and a half, pretty much. Just went through memory lane. Remember, memory, 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 memory lane, memory, memory lane, memory lane. <laughs> scrapbooks. Basically, memory lane. A lot of memories were in those scrapbooks. There were a lot of memories in there. There were a lot of memories and memories. Yes, I'm wearing two glasses. I'm wearing my sunglasses and my cheaters. I heard if you wear cheaters a lot, your eyes get used to them and you need to wear cheaters more. I don't know if that's true, but I think that's true in my my thing. Maybe They're I should stop. tricking you. It's tricking me. I should stop wearing them. And with these cheaters, I know as I'm looking up, which is making my forehead get wrinkly, which I think I need Botox oh, no. now. Wow, it's a conspiracy. Yes. Because you know, They're when all you in wear cheaters together. together. Yeah. Because you know when you wear cheaters, you're looking down, but then if you want to look normal, look at something without the cheaters, you got to force your eyeballs up, which makes your forehead wrinkle. I've never worn glasses, like vision glasses, but I kind of want to. I just think they're cute. They are. I don't mind them. I just don't have to. I don't like to rely on them, but yeah, I don't actually mind it too much. I wouldn't mind if I had to wear them all the time and just leave them there. But the only thing is, when you're looking at something normal, it's too, you know, it gets blurry. It's only for reading. So you gotta go back and forth. But we thought we would take you along on this trip while we're leaving Vegas because, you know. Because it's boring out here. And it's boring out here. In the desert. Boring out here in the desert. I got a mustache with this shadow. It's bad lighting. Sorry for the bad lighting, but this is on my phone. For GoPro. Um, Wait, you're shooting us with bad lighting? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, we got sunglasses on. Oh. You know, we got sunglasses on. It's all good. But um, that's all we can really tell you. Just follow us on our um, social media. On our Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube. Yes, he has a YouTube channel. When I get home, I'm going to put it in the description box for her YouTube channel. Follow Bridget. I haven't posted yet, but I will. Well, she has a scary video of a uh, wizard, her cat. And my dog. And her dog. She has scary, scary videos of her animals. No, I have a scary movie I shot of. Yeah. <laughs> There'll be more. There'll be more, and then this one I'm going to try to post up for Thursday morning because I don't have anything for Thursday morning. Because the last two videos I posted up were um, kind of sad. I was like, no makeup, eating crappy food, sitting on on the in the living room floor. She needed girl time. Yeah, I needed girl time. I was crying. I go, you know, all I want is to get married, and I want a guy. Like I don't ask for much. I just want a guy to kill a spider, open a salsa jar take out the trash and remember my birthday. That's not asking for much. Huh. Right? And maybe hold my hand and give me a hug. That's it? Yeah. Paying the rent would be nice. <laughs> or at least helping out. That'd be nice. I mean, I don't want a deadbeat. I want someone that actually, you know, does something. Being cute would be nice too, but I'm not that picky. Oh, so he doesn't have to be cute? Well, he has to be cute in my eyes. But cute in my eyes, or sometimes it's not cute in other people's eyes. Like, I think we had this conversation. I think Jeff Goldblum is cute. We have had this conversation. <laughs> I think Steve Boshimi is cute. We have had this conversation. <laughs> I um. think he's cute. Like, I would totally date a Steve Boshimi. He's hot. Of course, I like the pretty boys too. I like Keanu Reeves. I like Elvis. I like Ricky Ricardo. I like Ricky Rackman. Of course, he's my ex-boyfriend, so I can't believe that doesn't really count. 
the interesting taste. Yeah. Oh, I like Billy Joe Armstrong from Green Day. I remember that oh, big crush. Oh, he's so dreamy. I can lick him like a salt lick. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, he's so okay. cute. Okay. That he's gave me a visual. So cute. <laughs> uh, and he's still around. He still looks great, too. Aren't you glad you logged on? Aren't we excited? <laughs> I should probably turn this off and turn it back on when there's something more exciting. We'll keep you posted. <laughs> we'll keep you posted. So, toodles. I'm going to go to Alien Jerky to see if they have vegetarian jerky. What do you think? Take me to your jerky. Take me to your jerky. Hey, we're lost. Can you show me how to get back on the freeway? Hey, they're not talking to me. Wow, you're not very friendly. Hey, look at this guy. Can you tell me if there's vegetarian jerky? Hey, you know there's vegetarian jerky? You guys pulled us over. These guys pulled us over. Because it's parking for aliens only. I'm going to see if we can find some tofu jerky. We found vegetarian jerky. This is considered vegetarian jerky. So yes, we found it. I'm petrified too. Why are you so petrified? This is what I got. I got chili lime gummy bears. And they're really good. Gummy bears coated in chili lime. Yummy. Hey, we're back on the road. We just stopped at Alien Jerky. She got roadkill jerky. Follow her on her uh, YouTube video because it's going to be our like a collab. So you get to see part of the road trip with me and part of the road trip with her. So if you want to know everything little stalkers you you gotta follow both of us okay because I'll give you half the story and she has half the story or else it's just not gonna make sense if you just follow one of us you gotta follow both now I'm a vegetarian as you know so I can't have beef jerky but they have dried fruit which is technically vegetarian jerky but I didn't get fruit I got spicy gummy bears chili lime flavored gummy bears and on her channel we did a taste test and she did a taste test of uh, roadkill. Yes, you got roadkill jerky. Like, that's mystery meat, right? That's <laughs> mystery meat. Like, who gets mystery meat? I don't know what's in it. It could be a, a hot dog beef jerky. It was really good, and it was very tender, just how I like it. She likes tender meat. <laughs> she likes really tender meat. I don't like it too chewy. I don't like it too chewy. Oh, but chewy, I don't mind. I just don't want dry. Yeah, I don't like dry meat either. You get that? You got that? It needs to be juicy. Juicy. So she goes. This is going in another direction. <laughs> what? I'm just talking about we like juicy meat. We just don't like dry meat that, you know, that you break your teeth on. <laughs> you know, like a little salt's okay. We want a little bit of sweetness to it. And sometimes mystery meat's okay. <laughs> Me? I'm a vegetarian, so. So I got the gummy bears. So no nutritional value whatsoever in this except for sugar and salt. Basically, I'm eating condiments. Condiments and pig soup. So that's it. And uh, just keep watching and I'll check in later. Where to now? Let's see what Peggy Sue's doing. Make a little pit stop. We're in Peggy Sue's. Lunch. Nifty 50. Dina, let's go see what they have for lunch. Huh? Here we go. Here we go. Enter here. Ooh. Oh, hey, Elvis. What's dripping out of your mouth there, Elvis? Please seat your beautiful selves. Wow, thank you, mister. Oh, wow. This is cute. 
Go, go, go. Sure, we can say anyone want. We are at Peggy Sue's Diner. We're having a beer. There's Bridget with her coat. Because she's driving. She's a responsible driver. Don't believe what they say. I always wanted to be a flow. I would love to work at a diner and be like, kiss my grits. Kiss my grits. I, I would, I'd be one of those attitude waiters, like really. Sorry, you get blue cheese and you're gonna like it. Sorry, you get Mr. Pip. We don't have that coke. You'll be fine with that. <laughs> Peggy Sue's Diner, I'm having a Miller, and there's Bridgie. She has chili cheese fries. I spy with my little eye what is on the wall. Who is on the wall? Who is that, Bridget? I have no idea. Who is that? Who is on the wall? Thank you. Yeah. There's Bridget. Uh -huh. That's the one that should have oh, served her. Awesome. And there's Bridget right there. Yay. And then there's Bridget right there. Oh, that's quick. Oh, that looks great. Yummy. I spy with my little eye. So if we could zoom in. Can you see my finger in there? Yeah. Who is that? I'm going to have to get up close because it's not focusing. What the hell? Come on, focus. Bridget has chili cheese fries. I can't have them because they have meat in it. I have a vegetable patty since I'm a vegetarian. But vegetarians could have beer, so that's good. And someone is keep staring at me. Bridget, you have four eyes. <laughs> I got the blues. The mac and cheese blues. I got the blues. The mac and cheese blues. I gotta take a picture. This is the back of Peggy Sue's diner. It is so cute. I love it. The bathroom of Peggy Sue's diner. <laughs> Graham, what are you doing here? Graham, this is the girl's bathroom. Get it. This is the bathroom of Peggy Sue's diner. Graham, what are you doing here? Look at this! Peggy Sue's Park. So we had to show her all around the dinosaurs, the turtles. I 
never been there before. Next time we gotta go to Calico Ghost Town. What do you guys think? If you want us to go to Calico's Ghost Town and film it, give this video a thumbs up so I know. If I get a, if I get, if I get over a thousand thumbs up, then we'll do it. But if I don't, sorry, we won't do it. So. Uh, <laughs> well, they can message you in the comments too. Maybe there's yeah. other cool places to go to. Yeah, let us know. It's like the Bridget and Stacey Road Show. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do something. I don't know. We'll go out. We'll go places, but I don't know. We're going places. We're going places. We're going places. Might be across the street, but you know what? That's a place, and we're going. <laughs> I don't know. But we're gonna put on some music now, so and we're gonna dance travel time. some more. Stay. Dance party. Dance party. So stay tuned. All right. This is Wizard Bridget's kitty cat. You're not a clown. You're not a clown. clown. You're not a clown. I want your butt. Winnie, Winner. I'm trying to get you. Get Winnie, get Winnie. There you are. Oh, there you were. <laughs> you were. There she is. There's a Winnie. There's a Winnie. That's the Winnie. Hi, Winnie. Oh, you're going to lick it? That's cute. That was a Winnie. On my way home, I cannot wait to park in my driveway and be home. It's gonna feel good. I hate LA traffic. I don't know how people can live in LA. The traffic here is so bad. It takes you two hours to go anywhere. How do you do it? It's crazy. I do want to say thank you, Holly, for your hospitality. Um, it was awesome. Thank you for lunch. Thank you for brunch. Thank you for sushi. I had a great time. Yeah, I'm still in traffic. I've been on the road since this morning. Yay! Well, it's 8.30. I'm finally home. Yay! And I miss my baby, so I'm gonna... Now I have a lot of things to do before I go to bed. But I just want to say thank you again to Holly for brunch and um, dinner. Dinner twice, sushi, and then Italian food one night thing. And thank you, Bridget, for driving. And it was so fun doing all the stops on the way home. Next time, we got to go to Calico Ghost Town. Make a note of it. And I have yet to check my lotto. Because when we went to a state line, me and Bridget got some lotto tickets. And I haven't checked them yet. So I might be a winner.